beautiful soft light, still, silent, with history. In 1897, at the age of 17, Murakami travelled from Tanami in Japan to Kosaki, Western Australia aboard SS Saladin. He came looking for gold, but he found himself working as a shop clerk for Nishioka Takazo, and then he became a photographer. In 1981, at the similar age as Murakami when he travelled to Australia, I arrived in Melbourne from Tokyo, Japan aboard QF21. I came looking for education, but I found myself working as a waitress in a Japanese restaurant. Later, I too became a photographer. The first day of war, the day after the Japanese bombing of Pearl Harbor, as with all Japanese in Australia, Murakami Yasukichi was arrested, an enemy alien interned. In our national archives, there's a record of the list of items that he had in his home. It was handed over to the authorities. There is no mention of Murakami's photographs or his negatives. What happened to his photographs and where are they now? Nine cases and one trunk, two wardrobes. Look at all these people buried here. Forgotten. Forgotten people. Far away from their home, their families. They came here, lived once, and contributed to the history of this country. To your history. Our history. You owe it to them, my son, to take the time to listen. 